Hello, hello guys. Uh, this is Vincent from Cornerstone Acres. Thank you for tuning in. Today we are talking a very interesting topic. Making your own chicken feed. So making your own uh, chicken feed at home can help in cutting down on the cost of purchasing uh, chicken feed. Formulating your own chicken feed is advantageous because you will be able to control the quality of the feeds that you are giving to your chickens. Saving on the cost and uh, feeding your chicken with a high quality chicken feed will ensure that you maximize on what? Or maximize on the profit. On record is that uh, chicken feed amount to about 65% to 75% of the cost of raising your pot or your chicken. So how do you go about uh, chicken feed uh, formulation? When making chicken feed, the digestible crude protein formula is used. And uh, without going into the math, the digestible crude formula is based on uh, the total percentage amount of protein in the chicken feed ingredients there is. So each, each, each uh, chicken feed ingredient has a different amount of digestible crude protein. Layers and uh, broilers require different amount of proteins at uh, different levels of their growth. So let us uh, look at uh, specific examples based on uh, making a 70 kg of uh, chicken feed. These are some of the samples or the, how you can make uh, your feeds. A 70 kg chick mash, a 70 kg layers mash, a 70 kg broiler mash. Here are the formulas. Making a 70 kg chick mash, one to four weeks old uh, chicks. So growing chicks require feed with the digestible crude protein. That is a DCP of between 18 to 20 percent. The following formulation can be used to make a 70 kg bag of layers chick mash. A formula for 70 kgs of layers uh, growers mash that is from age 4 weeks to 18 weeks. It is uh, very necessary that pullet should be provided with feed having a protein content of between 16% and uh, up to 18% crude protein. Such feeds make the pullet to grow fast and prepare them for egg lay. So the following ingredients can be used to make a 70 kg bag of uh, layers growers mash. We now move on to make a layers mash but uh, you should not take note that layers feed should never be fed to chickens younger than 18 weeks as it contains high calcium content that can damage the kidneys of the chickens they can uh, develop uh, that is uh, they can develop what we call kidney stones which interfere with egg production and uh, also this can go a long way to shorten the lifespan of the layers. So the best uh, or the alternative uh, way you can do is you can start feeding your birds with the layers mash when they start uh, laying 5% of their total number. That is 5% uh, of the pot of the chickens that uh, you are keeping have started laying. 
So the following ingredients can be used to make a 70 kg bag of layers, layers uh, mash. formulating broiler feed broilers have a different feed requirement in terms of energy proteins and minerals during different stages of their growth so therefore it is important that farmers adapt a feed rations to these requirements that is for maximum production Young broilers have high protein requirement for the development of muscles, feathers, and ETC. As the broilers grow, their energy requirements for the deposit of fat increases and their protein requirement also. The protein requirements in this case uh, decreases. They require high protein content in their starter rations than in the growers and uh, the finishers uh, rations. So broilers, broilers should have a feed that has uh, between 22% to 24% digestible crude protein. So the following guidelines can be can help the farmer to make the right feed at uh, each uh, stage of growth. So we will start with the formula for 70 kg of uh, broiler starter feed. That is uh, 1 to 4 weeks. Of age. And uh, finally, a formula feed formula for broilers uh, that is uh, we are making a 70 kg of uh, broiler finisher feed that is uh, now four weeks and above when making homemade uh, feed uh, rations it is important to do experimental trials Isolate a number of uh, chickens, feed them and uh, observe their performance. If the feed rations are right for broilers, they will grow fast and the layers, if it is for the layers, they will uh, increase egg production. That is at least one egg uh, at uh, every 27 hours. Farmers, you should be very careful with the quality of feed ingredients the raw materials especially or it is uh, important to note that chickens are very sensitive to feed that contain mycotoxins which are uh, present in most of the raw materials so never use rotten maize to make chicken feed always buy quality fish meal from reputable companies if a uh, local fish meal is used you must be sure of its quality it's very important to mix all the micronutrients there that is i mean the amino acids and the premix first before doing what mixing with the rest of the feed so for mixing farmers are advised to use a drum mixer and this one is uh, available in uh, most of the local areas the local artisans uh, make this as you can see in this video as uh, I will not advise using a shovel to mix feed because the ingredients may be may be unevenly distributed. If uh, you didn't in the mix the amino acid and the premix properly, so so to improve on the feed quality, farmers making their own uh, pot of feeds. You should always have it tested to ensure the feed is well balanced. 
you can take uh, your samples to agro allied laboratories for testing to ensure the feeds are balanced nutritionally thank you guys thank you for tuning in hope uh, that will be helpful to you farmers and in case uh, you have a topic that uh, you want us to discuss please uh, mention it in the discussion uh, below discussion uh, part uh, below the video and uh, don't forget to subscribe hit that uh, notification bell so that uh, you're notified anytime we upload videos thank you guys